y'all welcome back to hidden truth i hope you guys are having a fantastic day sedona actually just got out of the shower and she's actually gonna come in here and i'm gonna have her take a pregnancy test because i have a sneaking suspicion <laughs> um she has been feeling a little strange she's feeling pretty bloated and i just have a sneaking suspicion that there might be a bambino in there and that's not a bad thing sedona and tyrell have been talking about trying for another baby oh there is a baby in there sedona and tyrell have been talking about having another baby for a while oh my gosh i'm so excited um but they just couldn't decide if now was the right time you know to have a baby but anyway, uh, Nasir is going to go out and uh, shoot some baskets for a little while. Um, he just got out of the pool. He's just been kind of lazing about all day today. Not really doing much of anything, but this sweet boy, he is so cute. I just love him so much. But we need to come in and share the news of the pregnancy. And then I think what they're going to do is they're probably going to call Nasir inside and talk to him about um you know possibly having a little brother or sister and kind of what he might think about that but this will definitely be Sedona's last baby she has now had four children and her body has been through it okay <laughs> she has been through it and i just think that she is is ready to stop you know <laughs> So Nasir's just come inside and he's like, hey guys, what the heck are you doing? And they're like, actually, come sit down. We want to, uh, we want to talk to you for a minute, buddy. I need to fix whatever is going on with Tyrell's pants because I'm not exactly sure why he doesn't have pants on. Um, <laughs> but Sedona's going to ask Nasir, we're going to ask him if he wants any siblings. We're going to let fate decide and see what he says. A new sibling? That could be nice. Oh, he's actually looking forward to maybe having a new sibling. And so Sedona's like, okay, well, I am glad to hear you say that because um, your daddy and I have just found out that I'm pregnant. Tyrell, come sit down. You are not going anywhere. We are having a family moment. <laughs> And she's like, well, mommy has a baby in my belly. You're going to be a big brother. And he's like, I am? And she's like, yes, honey, you are. Let's have her go give him a big hug. This is such a cute little family moment. And then I want her to, I want her to express her love for him too, because I just want him to know that like, even if we have another baby, that doesn't mean we love you any less. It doesn't mean that, oh, it's so cute. She's like, that doesn't mean that your daddy and I love you any less. He's like, I know, mom. She's like, okay, well, it's 11 o'clock and you need to be in bed. So I need you to go. I need you to go get ready for bed. So we're going to have him come in and use the restroom and then once he's done with that he's gonna go in and uh and get some sleep he's feeling pretty tired but uh it looks like Ty tyrell has already taken himself to bed but i think sedona is going to stay up just a little bit later tonight and work on some uh video production stuff so we're gonna have her um let's actually can we have her study the trends really quick? Because I want to see what's like, you know, what's trending first and then see if we can like make a video based on what's trending. So you have to keep in mind too that Sedona is doing very well in um, beauty reviews, fitness, focus vlog. Okay, so let's do a beauty review. Record video, beauty tips. Um. But anyway, she is doing really, really well with acting. 
Um, but getting into like social media and learning how to create videos and stuff like this is all something that she's never really done before. Um, so this is something that she's kind of dipping her toes into. And honestly, I love it. I think it, that she is going to be so good at this. And I think it may be something that she could really enjoy as well. So here's the other thing. On top of Sedona, yes, she's very happy about, you know, this pregnancy and having another baby and and all of that. I think she's also really nervous about what Donovan is going to say um, when he finds out that she's pregnant again. <laughs> um, because you guys have to keep in mind, Donovan also doesn't know that he has um, another little brother. I mean, he knows that Nasir is his little brother now, um, but he doesn't know that he has another little brother out there somewhere. All right, let's go ahead and edit this Everyday Makeup Essentials video. All right, it has been successfully edited. So now it's a good quality. So let's go ahead and upload that video. Fantastic. So once you're done with that, we can have you go ahead and get some sleep because she has a big day tomorrow. She is, um, Oh my gosh, it was nominated for an award Sunday at 7 p.m. Oh my gosh, that's crazy. I will have to try to remember that. That way we can actually go to the Starlight Accolades because I actually don't think it's for that video. I think what it's probably for is the latest movie that she was in. I think that's a little more believable uh, than the first video that she has uploaded in her entire life but she's gonna go ahead and get some sleep because today she has a lot going on she has to go stop by her mom's house um, because she needs to have a conversation with her mom about what they're gonna do um about donovan and then after that she is actually going to go over and see her father for the first time in quite a long time um, her and her father did make up. They are on better terms than they were. So if you look here at her relationship panel, you'll see uh, her relationship with Jason isn't super high, but it's definitely better than it was. Uh, but after she goes to talk to her mom, she's actually going to go meet his new fiance, who she has not met yet. And we met her in the last episode. Um, so I'm really excited for Sedona to get to meet her. That's very exciting. Uh, let's have Tyrell take a quick shower here. So it's about six in the morning, which means Nasir needs to be getting up and getting ready for school. He is going to take a quick bath and then he needs to brush his teeth and kind of get ready to head downstairs for breakfast. And then she is going to get ready to go see her mom. All right, so Sedona just stepped out of the cab and Nancy was out here waiting on her. We're gonna have Sedona come and hug her mom. She's like, hi, mom. Nancy's like, hey, sweetheart, how are you? I've missed you so much. She's like, I'm okay, mom, I'm okay. Um, I have a lot to tell you, but um, first, I need to tell you something, um, and it's something really important, and I, I don't know what you're going to think, but I'm excited. I am pregnant. She's like, oh, honey, that's fantastic. I'm so happy for you. Oh, she just keeps hugging her over and over again. That's so sweet. She's like, well, my first ultrasound is actually uh, tomorrow. I'll be in my second trimester officially by then, and I should find out the gender of the baby. Um, they're going to put it in an envelope for me so that I don't know, but I want you to be the one to open the envelope and find out what the baby is for the first time. So would you be willing to do that? I just, I want to have a big gender reveal party. And her mom's like, oh, honey, of course, I would love to. Thank you so much for allowing me to do that. She's like, well, I thought maybe we could have it here at the ranch. And Nancy's like, oh, my gosh, yes, we could have it outside. It'll be so beautiful. You know, like Nancy is, Nancy's all for it. So we're going to have Sedona come and 
knock on the door just so that we're able to actually get into the house. And she sees Dallas out here, and so she's going to come and she's going to say hi. She's like, hey, Dallas, it's been a while. How are you? And Dallas is like, I'm great. What are you here for? We haven't seen you here in a long time. And so she is going to tell Dallas as well that she is pregnant. Oh, he scared her. <laughs> She's like, well, you are going to be a grandpa again. And he's like, no way. Oh, Sedona, that's fantastic. Oh, I'm so happy for you guys. And she's like, thank you so much, Dallas. We are so excited. We're really hoping that, you know, everything goes well, but this will be our last pregnancy. So, and her mom's like, well, I, for one, am hoping that this one is a girl. I've had enough boys for one lifetime. And uh, <laughs> Sedona's just kind of giggling. And she's like, well, I don't care what it is as long as it's healthy. And Dallas is like, oh, you can never have too many little boys. So <laughs> Dallas wants it to be a boy. Nancy wants it to be a girl. She's like, actually, mom, why don't we go inside and sit because... We need to have a conversation about Donovan anyway. Nancy's like, well, do you want anything to drink, honey? You want anything to eat? Sedona's like, no, I'm, I'm okay for right now, mom. Thank you. So they're going to have a little deep personal conversation here. And she's like, mom, what are we going to do about Donovan? And Nancy's like, oh, honey, he'll come around. You know, don't worry about it. Don't stress. It'll be fine. You know, and she's like, no, mom, I am worried about it. Like, what if he goes looking for Grady? And Nancy's like, oh, surely he wouldn't go looking for, for him, you know? And Sedona's like, actually, I'm not sure that he won't go looking for him. And he's not going to like what he finds. And Nancy's like, what do you mean? And she's like, mom, have you been watching the news? And Nancy's like, well, well, only like, the you know chestnut ridge local news i guess i haven't been really paying much attention to news in other areas why she's like mom uh, grady's in prison and nancy's like what <laughs> she's like yeah mom grady's in prison um he was arrested for embezzlement and they put him in jail and I don't, you know, I don't want, um, I don't want Donovan to find out that, like, that's who his dad is, you know? Nancy's like, oh, honey, everything will be all right. Don't worry about it. Maybe we can just say that we put a fake name on the birth certificate. And she's like, well... Grady's last name is spelled wrong on the birth certificate anyway, Mom. His last name is Henderson, and it's on the birth certificate as Harrison. And Nancy was like, oh, yeah, I forgot that your dad wrote his last name wrong down on the, on the paperwork for the birth certificate. And Sedona's like, oh, my gosh, Mom, I just, I, I can't, I can't do this. I need to, I need to go. I'm supposed to be meeting Dad and Sandra for dinner. I just, I have to go. Nancy's like, okay, honey, don't worry about it. Everything will be fine. Don't stress too much, you know. Um, but Sedona is not convinced that Donovan isn't going to go searching for his biological dad. So Sandra actually came out to meet Sedona. And so Sedona is going to introduce herself to Sandra. She's like, hi, Sandra. It's so nice to meet you. Sandra's like, it's lovely to meet you too, dear. Sandra's like, uh, your dad has told me so much about you, you know. And Sedona's like, listen, that's all great. I would love to get to sit down and talk to you some more, but I am starving. Can we please go get something to eat? I'm freaking out a little bit because my game just took me to the uh to the manage world screen or like to this like world screen and it's done this twice now and it won't let me back into I'm freaking out it better work this time
I'm going to freak out if it doesn't. <laughs> oh my goodness. Thank goodness it worked. Holy freaking cow. Okay, I have to check out that last exception later. There's Sandra. Sandra has arrived. Thank goodness. Okay, let's go ahead and go request a table. I am going to change Sedona out of this outfit that she's in because I'm not feeling that for this restaurant. This restaurant is actually really nice. Um, so we're going to change her into this outfit. Don't they all look so nice? Oh my goodness. They are so cute. Okay, let's go ahead and place our order for the table. Now, keep in mind, Jason does not drink anymore. Um, and out of respect for Jason, Sandra also does not drink. So, and because Sedona's pregnant, she's not going to be drinking either. She's just going to get a water. And then we're going to skip appetizers. I think we're going to move right on to the main course. Uh, Jason is going to go with a steak. Uh, I think Sandra is going to go with the salmon. And I think Sedona is kind of torn between the ham dinner and the grilled chicken. But I think she's actually going to go with the grilled chicken for today. So after they have placed their order and everything, she is going to, oh, or maybe she's just going to do it right now. She's just going to announce the news of her pregnancy. And her dad's like, Sedona, that's wonderful. I am so excited for you and for Tyrell. And I hope you know that Sandra and I cannot wait to meet this new baby. She's like, thanks, dad. I'm I'm really excited. I think this is going to be my last one, but I'm I'm really hoping to enjoy things as much this time around as I did with Nasir because my pregnancy with Nasir was wonderful and I really want to have that same experience this time with whoever this baby is. And so maybe let's uh talk a little bit more about the baby and stuff. Maybe let's ask uh, preferred baby names, Craig for a boy and Peria for a girl. I, I don't, I don't know, Jason. I don't, I don't know about that. Um, can I make suggestions for the name of your future child? What about Craig for a boy and Peria for a girl? Listen. <laughs> As much as I appreciate this suggestion, I'm just not sure that I like it, okay? <laughs> Here's your order. Enjoy. Thank you so much. Oh my gosh, I am starving. This is so nice, though, to be able to sit and just have a dinner with her dad and with Sandra. And honestly, those two are very, very cute together. They are very cutesy. They are flirting with each other all the time. I love it. I think it's adorable. But it's just nice to see Sedona be able to actually interact with her dad in a way that's positive because their relationship was so negative for so long. So her having this opportunity to have, you know, a, a positive interaction with her dad is a beautiful thing. And I'm really excited for her. So she is loving this. She is having the best time. They are laughing and joking and I just want her to maybe have a discussion about healthy relationships. And she's like, you know, I know that you and mom were happy for a long time. And then there came a point in your life when you weren't. But I am so proud of you for everything that you've done to turn your life around and I'm so happy that you found such a beautiful relationship between you and Sandra. And I want you to know that, you know, you guys have my blessing. I hope you guys have a beautiful marriage and enjoy spending the rest of your lives together. And they're like, you know what, Sedona, that was beautiful. Thank you so much for that. We really appreciate that. And Sedona's like, you know what, why don't we, why don't we order some dessert? And then we'll head home because this pregnant lady is absolutely craving a little bit of apple pie. So uh, Sandra's like, you know what? That sounds good. I'll have that as well. And Jason is actually just going to go with the fruit cobbler. That's one of his favorites. So he's going to get the fruit 
uh, the fruit cobbler. But so they're talking a little bit more about Sedona's pregnancy. And she's like, well, you know, I figure out tomorrow what I'm having. Um, I'll officially enter my second trimester tomorrow. And that's when they can actually tell me the sex of the baby and everything. So I'm really excited. I can't wait to find out if we're having a little boy or a little girl. She was like, you know, after three boys, I'm kind of ready for a girl, but honestly, I couldn't care less. As long as it's healthy, you know, that's what I care about. And now they have their pie and everything. We're going to tell a little bit of a funny story. Um, but they have their pie. They have their cobbler. They're just kind of enjoying their dessert. So we're going to allow them to do that. We're going to go ahead and end this episode here. I hope you guys enjoyed watching Sedona sort of try to build this relationship with her dad back to a more healthy place um, because I have really enjoyed getting to see them interact with each other in such a positive way. I think it's a beautiful thing. So thank you guys so much again. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a like and a comment down below. Make sure that you're subscribed to the channel and I will see you all next time. Bye guys.